Hi guys, I'm Yumna. Hi everyone, I'm Monica. And today we're gonna go through the products that we've been keeping an eye on for the past couple of weeks and that we find very unique. And since it's our first time trying these products, I think it's gonna be like a genuine review and we're just gonna see how we make of them for the first time. Yeah, let's yeah, go. Let's go. Look at this packaging. Oh Look at this gosh. red. I love it. Like it's popping. I'm already excited. Oh my gosh. Is that food in our box? Oh With my the gosh. Lip balm? Oh my god. It's a red pepper paste lip balm. And we also got a jar of uh, red pepper paste. Whoa. And the brand is actually also vegan. Even better. We should try it. <laughs> anyway, I think I remember reading a review about um, this actually. So uh, one of our users said that they tried it and it made their lips very plump, but they didn't really see like a difference in the colors. Oh. So maybe we can try and see what okay. we can do with it. Are right? our lips gonna be fine? <laughs> like it's so strong. It is. Oh, I thought it was gonna be darker than this. Oh. Wow. Ooh. We Let's should try, try it on, it on lips. lips. Yeah. I don't know how I feel about the color though. <laughs> Oh, really? it looks good on you. Really? <gasps> wow. Oh my gosh, you look so natural. Thank you. Wow. It but, is really plump though, like my... Yeah, but I don't really feel any taste of red pepper. All right, let's see the green one. Where's the green one? Ooh, ooh okay. But it's very really? like, like yeah. transparent. Does it have like, does it have a singy feeling too? Yeah, a little bit. A little bit. I yeah. like that. I like the Why one that I tried too. Yeah. Like I've never, I don't really do like red colors because I usually avoid like really like bright, vibrant too, colors. Like if this, if this was the color of the lipstick, I would not wear it. But <laughs> since it's so like light and natural looking yeah. and it's so moistury, like yeah. it moisturizes my I lips. I love how like, it looks so glowy. It looks it's, really glowy. So yeah, I would the definitely. The highlight of this product, definitely. Hi, it's Smita. Hi, I'm Yumna. What are we trying today? Um, wasabi cleanser and wasabi blemish cream. Mm, interesting. Wasabi? <laughs> I've never, I've never ever had a product have wasabi in it. Same. I've only like eight wasabi. How would it be on the skin? Does I don't it know. Act, like actual wasabi? No, it says it contains wasabi, japonic uh, root extract. Oh. oh. It has vitamin C in it. Oh. Ooh. Huh? And it's cruelty free. Interesting. Wow. This actually looks like wasabi that I get in the sushi restaurant. Okay, let's see if it rubs off. Oh wow. This smells really good, guys. Oh my gosh, this is actually really nice. And it makes my skin so soft. Smell that. It smells really, it smells it smells like really good. good. Doesn't smell like wasabi at all. Oh, interesting. <laughs> Should we try the cream? Yeah, sure. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> it's burning! I'm kidding, I'm kidding. It feels like cool on my skin, mm. so. Instead of burning, yeah. I get really dry skin. Yeah. So like, I always need something like, really, really like, moisture and mm. stuff. Cause there's some, sometimes it's not as like, like suitable for my skin because yeah. it gets dry so easily. Mm. So it has to have just the right amount of moisture. Mm. And it's no animal testing and it's vegan. Actually, this product is quite nice. Hi, I'm Nicole. So let's see what we've got here. I think I already saw it on our TikTok. I mean, I saw that it changes based on like your skin pH. So as I can see, we can put it both on our lips and cheek. So let's see. Oh, it's very pink. Yeah, but on you, it looks a little bit more, more ready. Yeah, yeah. yours is very purple. Look at this. <laughs> oh, isn't that too much? <laughs> but yours still more like reddish, I would say. Mm. Will it even come off? <laughs> oh, I really want to try this one, just like just to see if it's gonna be the same red. But I don't think it's so. It's very bright. Oh my it's god, this one's like mustard. <gasps> oh my god, you've got ketchup. Yeah, this is basically like ketchup. Very okay. bright yellow. Mm. Oh yeah, that one's really red. Yeah, how mine. You can, can you even see it? Yeah, it just looks like a lip balm, like transparent just, yeah. one. It's like 
like just lip gloss. I really like this though. Like it was interesting to see it. <laughs> I think like when you see the colors, it's like a huge shock at first. So yeah. When you put it on, less less shock. Yeah, definitely, especially the blue. The blue, <laughs> the blue well, mind blowing. Hey guys, uh, I'm Jared, and I work here as a div at Picky. Let's see what we have. Snail bee high potent essence. What 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 snail bee? <laughs> what snail bee? Oh, this one is a 90% snail mucin and bee venom as well. How can snail be like good for your skin? I've never heard such a thing. I've actually heard it's quite good for acne prone skin. Yeah? Wait, actually, let's see the product. Oh, wow. Oh, kind of reminds me of like a snail. Yeah, it's very like gel texture. Yeah, it doesn't feel weird. It feels. Yeah, it's very good. cooling actually. Yeah. Wait, I'll, I can put it in your hand. All right. Yeah, yeah, guys, I broke my wrist. How is it? I don't know. Like, hmm. I guess it's. it's Feels good. Can, is it good for your face as well? Or is yeah, it yeah, it's good for your skin. <laughs> <laughs> Hmm. Yeah, I had no idea that snail bee could be so good for hydrating your skin. Yeah, wow. I've never, I've heard of like snail mucin, but never bee venom. That's very interesting. And too. what's bee venom? Bee ah, venom. venom. What? Yeah, it's so cool. Mm. Awesome. Right, hi. So, Jared. Yes. This is a bean cream by Mixoon. And I actually heard of it. Um, it's like a, it's made out of soybean extract. Right. And yeah. um, it has like a combination of like pomegranate, uh, barley, and it also has- um, Korean pear, I heard. Korean right? pear, yeah. Korean pear. So um, I think the combination of the three would be really good for your skin, right? Because right. they're all three really, really moisturizing. Yeah. So should we try it out? Yeah, let's give it a shot. <laughs> you can put it on your face. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, it feels really good. Really cooling, very hydrating. <laughs> For the people who don't like strong fragrances, I think this is a really great cream. <laughs> this is actually really moisturizing. I really like it. I was saying before that like um, mm. my skin gets really dry. Yeah. So like I need like the perfect amount of moisture. How much would you rate it out of 10? Um, I mean, after applying it to my face, I feel way better. My skin feels so hydrated. I'll probably give it an 8 out of 10. 8 out of 10? I would give it a, a 9.5 out of 10. Yeah. You look really shiny now. Oh, thank you. <laughs> all right thank you so much for watching these were all the products that we had for you today and we hope you enjoyed our little first impressions of those products um it was a really fun experience to see all of the random things that are out there right now but it seems to me it was really nice hopefully you enjoyed as much as we did hope you can like the video and you know follow us on our social medias and let us know in the comments bar below which one of the products you like the most all right thank you so much have a great Bye. one